All right, so as you all know, the big update of the year, New Year, is almost here. So be ready for that. A lot of uh, a lot of hype stuff in that entire thing. But with it, before that actually drops, we do have a few things leaving over here in Nikkei, which I wanted to remind you that they all exist. And there's a lot and a lot in here. So do not do not miss out on this. It is uh, kind of stupid because there were a lot of like freebies and like cool things in this event. So again, I'm going to go over everything that should be expiring with this newest update. If I cover something that isn't expiring just yet, it's fine. I'll just, you know about it, at least now if you didn't. With that being said, let's jump into it. If you're new to the channel, like subscribe. Helps out a ton. First thing to start off with, we'll talk about the recruit banner. Um, we have both the banners leaving, right? Three days, they're basically gone. Or rather, one day and eight hours. Damn, I'm off. Uh, yeah. Yeah, they're, really, they're leaving pretty soon, actually. So, yes, if you would like to go for these uh, for these banners, you definitely can. If you don't want to, you leave them. They're limited characters. They might not return for one entire year. That is probably how it's going to go. But, again, you have Modernia releasing right after this a Pilgrim banner, which will be pretty, pretty spicy. That might be the quick focus that you might have instead of this. Again, I understand that both ways are valid. If you wanted to summon for this for limited nature, that's perfectly fine. I'm not going to stop you. We hate you or say like you did the wrong thing. I'm just saying again, it's either this or that. You decide whatever you want. If waifu was the reason you're uh, summoning or just absurd cuteness, I don't know what you summoned for, but whatever you summoned for, that is the reason you went for it. Again, Rupee, Winter Shopper, and um, what is it? The other one being and both leaving. So go and have fun. Do whatever you want. Decide one day in eight hours that will be out of the... Uh, the game also, all of the like gifts they gave for Christmas will be expiring in the mail. So there might be a few things that uh, are dipping. Um, all the codes also, I don't think they're still active. It was like, let me check, Nikkei KR, Nikkei Christmas. Uh, what was it? I don't know if they're expired just yet, but all the Christmas stuff of CD keys will probably expire then if they haven't already. So Nikkei KR, Nikkei KR, Happy Holiday 2022. And that's it. Or uh, was it try Nikkei Xmas EU. Try those three gift codes. See if they still work. Most likely they don't, but you can definitely still try it. Um, there is no harm in that. With the event tab itself, we've already finished coordinate operations. But again, if you haven't already bought anything from the shop, you're more than welcome to. The two banners already went through. Um, we have this. So the, uh, the winter pass will be leaving. If you haven't already purchased it or decided to like finish it and claim all the rewards and stuff like that, go and do it. Again, overall, the Winter Pass is worth it in comparison to every other purchase you make in the game. Realize when I say that in the future and for future content, when I say it, that it's worth it, I mean like comparing it to other garbage in the game that's like priced absurdly high, that is a good value, right? You're getting a Christmas skin that's limited, you're getting some summons and stuff like that. Overall, it's not a bad deal, so if you wanted to buy it, you definitely got away with it. We have the new one releasing, which is going to be for Helm, which looks outstanding. If you want that one, it'll be $20, same way, um, and that's the entire thing there. So we're going to finish up the uh, Mission Pass, the Winter Pass. I think also the Mission Pass is any too, so finish that up. Um, it'll be a different, I think it's Julia. Is it Julia? Or no, it's, um, I don't know who it is for next month. We literally just got the patch notes. It's either Julia or the other one um, for uh, for next month. But with it, we also have the Miracle Snow event, which I'm going to load up here, all right? I most likely have to cut the video because it's so freaking hard to load into. Um, this event is so annoying. Like, the whole game just died uh, trying to manage this event. This is how long it takes me to load up a PC. And if it doesn't load, it will crash or it'll just sit here. And then I have to X out of the game myself which I might... No, I don't have to. There we go. See, I loaded in. Okay. Takes a while, but you do get in here. Um, and with the entire thing, right? So we first have the login event. Make sure you finish that up. I got that out of the way. If you haven't already claimed it, go claim it because it will like it'll stock up. So if you logged in for the days regularly um, and you know you just hit claim now, you can claim all the stuff that you had. It's not like you had to log in and then claim and then claim and then claim. It already kind of tracked for you because um, I logged in the eight days. After I got this, I stopped like claiming it. And then at the last day, I just claimed it all. Um, so that's how I kind of did it there. But that's overall right there. The mini game also go and finish that up. Get your uh, your runs in. I have a bunch of runs to like complete here. I think I have stocked up. Um, I think I did them yesterday. Actually, no, I don't actually. Let's see. The loading time in the game is still really bad for uh, for PC. Um, I don't know why. It's like it was good until recently, until like a day or two ago. Um, and now it's just slow again. But yeah, that's it. So again, get your runs done. Get this out of the way. Um, finish up that. Just get your boxes. Open them up afterwards, too. And let me know what you get. If there's anything good in them. Ah, uh, come on, man. <laughs> this is so... The loading is so bad. I don't know why. Like, it was working again, like, after I updated it from the uh, original patch. Um, and then since then, it's just, like, fine. And then yesterday, or the day before, it got slow again. And it's like, oh, damn. Come on, bro. Uh, but with that out of the way, we have the shop, right? So, yeah, make sure you clear out the shop already and finish all that. Um, like, you know, sort it out. I still have a lot to go. I haven't pur uh, purchased these yet, but I will most likely. Yes, I'm not a whale, but like the value you're getting for 100 gems only, you're basically getting able to clear out some other stuff here and you're getting some guaranteed drops on the side. So I might just dabble in one uh, full set of, of all of it. Uh, so I'll probably clear out all of this. Yeah. And then I'll just jump into these. I'll see. I'll see how much I clear out. But the value for like materials is 
really worth it, right? So in the end, yes, I'm losing on premium currency, but I've already guaranteed myself to get Modernia, so that doesn't really matter to me, um, which means I can just dive in and just have fun with this. So that is most likely gonna be my plan and uh, my goal here to get out of the way uh, but again make sure you clear out the shop make sure you check out everything i um, mean also across the map right you have those little gifts that are like literally everywhere um i'll see if i can drop a video later on giving you all the locations just to make sure you've got everything um but i have an account that literally hasn't done any of it yet so that'll be uh, pretty easy but there's literally drops all over the map i highly recommend you just go all over the place like spam clicking and trying to find them there are hidden like areas like this one over here you have to go like into this uh like house or cabin or whatever like right here there's like two right there um then you know you just go down here to this path over right here there's a bunch down here so just get that out of the way clear out all of them there's a lot and a lot of those little tiny freebies uh lying around i think altogether it's like 200 or uh let's say 200 i don't want to like over uh, overestimate it but i think it's like 200 gems just lying around in the entire event itself um so there is a lot of stuff there so please go around the tree go around down here in this carnival area um go around down here next to this fountain and check everything over here um again check the spawn area check this little uh i think it's this one of them too um this has something too i think so yeah one right here so again check every area go into every nook and cranny of this entire um entire map and try and find them i'll see if i can drop a video after this with all the locations that's actually a good idea to get out of the way um but again make sure you'll check out your missions area make sure you hit claim all here get all of this currency um i still haven't cleared out this whoops i didn't clear out uh 1-12 i forgot that's a thing also clear out hard mode all right you've been a lot of people didn't know about this they didn't check the bottom right but when you get to story two you have to do hard mode also um so please do that finish that up again with the daily just do those regularly get to the uh thousand uh, or the hundred p and get this extra one um for some extra boxes but get this whole entire event cleared out squared away um so that you can just go and get those extra rewards um there's a lot of stuff right so there's a lot of stuff in the shop area um so do clear it out get those events recruit um vouchers and everything else the login basically as mentioned just make sure you claim all of that there too um but that's really it on that uh side of things I'll let this load for half a century or millennia, uh, and then I'll get to the next part. Come on, please load. Please load. I'll just cut it. If it, if it doesn't load in three, two, one, I'll cut three. Oh, there we go. Thank God. Uh, but yeah, go over here to uh, to shop. If you want to buy this stuff, you don't have to. Um, it's not in this area. It's in cash shop, right? If you want to, again, buy this, you can, but I'll alert you that most likely it's leaving. So over here in this tab, yeah, it's the overpriced freaking stuff right here. $20, bro. $20 per costume. That's 80 bucks plus the 20 from the mission pass that is 80 or 100 rather dollars that you just spent on a, on a gacha game during christmas for just costumes uh which is a hey, it's a lot of money but if you want these they're most likely leaving these are event based this is special right so i don't know if these will stay for a while um or if this one's like special and it ends i don't know where they put the date on these things i could be stupid uh but i don't see the date so i don't know where it's uh specifically put um to like when they're ending but just make sure that you're aware that these might be uh leaving in a few days so i do recommend that you go and pick them up and get that all out of the way um otherwise you know you'll miss out on some uh some decently they look cool but still they're they're, they're poorly priced I, I can't literally say anything on it it's poorly priced all right 20 bucks per costume is, is terrible uh if it was like you get mats on the side like if they all were based how the mission pass is based right like let's say you purchase it and instead of just getting the skin you get like a multi or two that's great all right that's good maybe some mats on the side like the winter pass is just so good that those are just put to shame on the uh on the side of you know costumes it's like that gives you a lot this doesn't so yeah, I'm sorry for I, I keep complaining about these, but yeah. Uh, with that being said, finish up all of that that I just mentioned. Have fun. Take care of that. Get that out of the way. I'll catch you in the next one. Have a stay safe. Peace out. Enjoy. That's been it for me. And yeah.